Hello everybody, Brad here today and welcome to the first episode in a brand new small scale farming series. Please consider subscribing down below if this is something that interests you and please feel free to like the video and comment as well if you enjoy it. So this is the six ashes map and what I'm going to be doing in the first part of this episode is just showing you around and showing you the land that we have. I'll post a Google Doc file down below and that will show you all of the tractors, vans, implements, everything that I'm using here in this series and then links for you to be able to go and actually have a look at those mods and download them if needs be. I try and download most of my mods from ModHub in the game, I just find it easier but I will link everything because there are a few bits which are from external sites. So like I said this is the six ashes map and we're starting off with a few bits of machinery over here in this shed so at the moment this is the only field that we own it's pretty small isn't it we're actually going to be working on expanding this field here over into these grass bits just here just to expand it a little bit and we're going to be planting potatoes in there and we have one greenhouse here if you have a little jog round this is my house and i've got a little water stand pipe there to help us then we've got a shed here which we can use and we've got two greenhouses over here. One is for potatoes, which I believe is this one. And the other one is onions. And then we've got a nice, again, grass field here, which we will likely turn into another small arable field. So there we go. That's the very quick tour. That's all we're starting off with in game. As you can see there in the top right hand of the screen, we are going to be starting off with 764 pounds. That is it. So that is all we're going to be starting off with. We have very limited machinery, very limited land. So we're going to try and make all of this land work for us and try and really make it as efficient as possible. So without further ado, let's get stuck in. Too many days in the darkness Without a glimpse of the light Running tired and broken and scared But I swear I'll never give up the fight I see you broken and beat Head pulled down over your eyes Every part of you wants to surrender Darling, you were meant to survive With every star We are Time in your head With it. 
Right guys, so we've already had quite a busy day already. Now, what I wanted to do is just before we start to think about doing other things to the field, I thought it would be good just to go and take care of our greenhouses. So we need to give them some water and some manure. So I've jumped onto the Ferguson tractor because I know that there's a guy up the road that has some pigs. So I've actually spoken to him before and he said that he is more than willing to help us out with manure and stuff. So what I thought we could do is just we'll have a quick trip up the road to his farm and we'll get some manure for our greenhouses. And the Ferguson with the manure fork and the small trailer on the back is perfect for this job. So there are the greenhouses. So let's go and pick up some manure from the guy down the road. Now we have actually got here as well look, the Land Rover Defender, which is such a cool mod. So if we ever need to pop out and just collect something, we can always use that. Um, but I thought because we actually need to use the manure fork, it's going to be much better to use the Ferguson tractor. Else we would have had to have taken the tractor and the Land Rover. So he's actually, he's actually just up here on the left. It's not very far away at all, actually. Um, this tractor does not go very fast, but it's absolutely fine for what we're doing here today. I think it's this turning. Is it this turning here? Yeah, there's some farm sheds here, look. Right, so let me just stop the tractor there and we'll get out and we'll open the gates. I don't know how many pigs he's got, I'm not sure. Oh, is this? Oh, there you go, look. There they are. I saw him at the farm shop, so I've actually never been to this farm. I've just walked past here. I've been on a nice country lane walk. This is such a nice area, honestly. It's, there's some really, really nice walks around here. Right, here we go. So let's, we'll park the trailer, because I assume the gate is just past the shed to get into the pig enclosure, the pig sty. So if we left the trailer like here, and then we'll go and open the gate. What way the gate, o ah, inwards, okay. Right, let's unhitch the trailer. So let's go back over to our farm. I'll give him a text when I get back home to ask him how much money he wants for that. I don't think he's ever going to want too much, like that might be £25, something like that. He's not going to want a lot for it because like I said he's got no real use for it. So let's take this back and we'll actually go and see if we can you know, pop this straight away into the troughs for our greenhouse. So let's squidge through here. I don't want to hit anything like my wheelie bins or my Land Rover. So let's go to the greenhouses and we'll get this in and then we'll give them some water as well. Okay, so let's give the greenhouses the manure first of all. So this might just go all into that one greenhouse. Let's just go and check what that says now because that was all for this um, greenhouse. I was about to say warehouse. So let's see here, how do I see, oh there we go. So we've got water and manure, okie doke. So we've got 1%, okay wow, yeah. So we might need a lot more manure for it to start making more money. So let's also sort out the water for this greenhouse and that one will just be offline. What is this one? Onions, oh okay. So let me get hooked up to the IBC and we'll get some water into this greenhouse ASAP.
Okay, so that was a busy day. We have managed to plough, cultivate and plant this small field just here. We've also managed to sort out our greenhouses out over there as well. So at least one of them now is actually starting to grow some onions. And you know, it's been a productive episode. We still need to pay Peter for the manure. So I will do that tonight when I go back into the house. And in our next episode, I think we'll be trying to sort out this field here. So we'll probably make this into either one larger field or maybe two smaller fields. I'm not too sure yet. Please, please feel free to post any opinions or any feedback down below in the comment section. Subscribe if you enjoyed this video. There'll be lots more coming your way. And like the video as well if you enjoyed it. Guys, thank you so much for joining us today. Take care of yourselves and I'll see you later. Thank you very much for watching the video guys, I really hope you enjoyed it. Please consider giving it a like and subscribing to the channel down below if you haven't done so already. And please feel free to follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Have a great day, see you later.